So, you've gone and got yourself a brand new Canon PixMahome MG2560. Good choice. Let's get it up and running. Stand up the box like so and then open it up. Remove the getting started guide as well as the smaller cardboard box which contains important bits and pieces for your printer. You can then place the box down and then slide out the printer. Remove the polystyrene packaging wraps then take the printer out of the bag. All the orange bits of tape and plastic can then be removed and recycled or discarded. Before you do that, make sure you're not throwing away anything that you'll need, such as the ink cartridges, power cable, installation disc and these bits of paper. Locate the power socket and plug in the cable. Make sure the wall outlet switch is off before plugging the other end into the wall. Now go ahead and press the power switch on the printer. To connect the printer to a computer, you'll need an A to B USB printer cable. We recommend a cable length of about 2 metres or so, but you can use cables up to 5 metres in length. Don't plug the cable in just yet though, you'll be prompted to do that when you install the software. Now it's time to insert the ink cartridges. Pull down the flap on the front side of the printer to reveal the ink cartridge slots. Remove the cartridges from their packaging and peel off the tank outlet seal. Slide them into the printer, taking care to align them properly into the right slots. There should be a discernible sound when you click them up into place. Close the flap at the front of the printer. The printer will then spend a few moments preparing the printer for action. To put paper into the printer, lift up the feed tray and then move the paper guides out to match your paper size. That brings us to the end of the initial setup phase. The next step is to install the software for your PC or Mac and then plug in the USB cable when prompted. This is covered in a separate tutorial video.